Hello everybody, welcome back to Justin Sally Art. Today we're going to do a rainbow bloom with vivid intense high flow fluid acrylics. And the colors that we're going to use today is fluorescent yellow, fluorescent yellow orange, Fluorescent red, fluorescent magenta, fluorescent red violet, fluorescent blue, and fluorescent green. I'm going to work on getting ultimate transparency with these colors and this bloom. I'm going to be doing it on a Glidden Satin Pure White Base One Pillow. And I have it in here and it's decanted. Let me grab a stick and I'll show you the consistency of this pillow paint. You can see it sits up for a little ways or a little bit of time before it goes in there. So fairly thick. I think it's going to be pretty good to work with. So that's our pillow. That's what we lay down first for our paints and colors to spread out across. Again, that's Glidden Satin Pure White Base One. That's what I use. Um, for most of our stuff but I switch it up I use colors to go a little bit too but this is my go-to for white all right so let's go ahead oh cell activator we're just going to use black and this is Amsterdam oxide black and Australian Floetrol and I mix that three parts Australian Floetrol to one part Oxide Black Amsterdam Paint. You can switch that up, go a little bit more Floetrol, a little bit less Floetrol, depending on how big or small you want your cells to come out. All right, let's lay down some color. Start with that yellow. Then we'll go to the orange. And I'm not laying down the colors in a traditional rainbow order because I like the way it looks this way. I think the transparencies play off each other better when I stack the colors in the order that I'll be stacking it. Let me know what you think in the comments or have you tried it starting with red first? If so, let me know. I tried it and it, I didn't think it came out that good for me. I think we'll do one more ring of that purple, darken up the outside a little bit, get a little bit more with the darker contrast and then we'll come in here with the blue and the green, 
blue, the, the purple, blue, and green at the end, I think, personally to me, looks better. Some people might not think that, but that's how I like it. Kind of like my circles that I do. Some people don't like the look of it. I like having some cells and some of the lines on the outside of my bloom. That's what I like and I enjoy. But I've had people comment that that don't like that, but that's a well to each his own. get some of that that's too much big old glob Alright, that's a little better. We'll probably spin that edge out anyways, right? It looks so psychedelic already. Alright, let's do this. Had to move quick because I put way too much cell activator down, but let's see if we can manipulate it a little bit, see what we can do.
if you're still here, I want to thank you for sticking around for the whole video. Please like, subscribe, and share. So here's the results. As you can see, there is tons of transparency. I think we locked down the rainbow. I'm loving it. I hope you guys enjoy it. See you on the next one.